welcome back to another episode. As you can see, we have our new guest here. <laughs> Hi, Miss uh, Bianca. Um, so today we're going to be talking about some juicy stuff. Um, it was our guest idea, so would you like to go ahead and tell the folks what we're talking about? Yes, so today we'll be talking about polygamy, um, relationships, um, so basically we'll we'll just cover um, my I, I don't know much about polygamy. I have a, I have a friend that I talk to. <laughs> Let me just say, yeah, I, I don't know much about polygamy. You know, I'm I'm basically like un, uneducated on it. Um, but I do have a friend that does do polygamy relationships, and she gave me a, a, quite a bit of insight on you know how it works and how it can be the pros and cons basically of everything. Okay. Okay. So um, to add to that, we also gonna be talking about swingers and people that bring others into the bedroom like threesomes open marriages open marriages we just gonna just talk about it all because i got some stuff to get y'all together on because it don't make no sense but okay. we're just gonna we're gonna <laughs> make go ahead and, and, and how you gonna make it make we're sense? gonna try to make it make it sense. makes sense <laughs> for somebody they doing it okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With this uh, four wives, you said that a guy had four wives. So it was a show, Sister Wives. It uh, since it premiered in 2010 with one man that had four wives. I never watched the show, but I was like, just because we dropped this subject on, I wanted to look it up to see. And it says it premiered uh, till 2016. I think it was the last episode of the show. But so throughout the whole season, they ended up becoming monogamous. Him and one woman. At the oh, end of the because season. it don't make sense to have four wives. <laughs> no, I did. You didn't get it wife. makes me want to go back and watch it now. I'm like, it must have been difficult to handle yeah. it for women. That's four. That's four different persons. How much money did he have? That's four. Yeah, exactly. You got to. He got some money, money once he started filming that show. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> maybe that's what happened. When money like got during involved. filming, how much money did he have? Like I don't know. I got, what was his living really situation? I want to know his living My friend situation. did say it gets expensive to have more than uh, two they, people in the they, relationship. It, it, it's expensive with kids. You they think I want four adults to yeah. take care of? You know, I don't know if they had, because they could have had multiple children and um, had four wives. So that's I'm too like, much. Why do I want to put take on four wives, though? I'm pretty sure he, I would hope he would be able to take care of them. Or yeah. they the dumb ones for getting so, with it. Knowing that my thing is, three people other are not getting into these for the overall. They get in it for the sex and That's stuff like that. That's what I was saying. So they don't. They're not thinking about A, B, C, and D. They just thinking about right now. Oh, I can sleep with multiple women every yes. day. Yes, and I feel like people, mostly men, mm -hmm. uh, they 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 do it to avoid being faithful. Yep. in their relationship. Yep, because it's always a man convincing. Whatever girl they with yep. to either have a threesome. Because men don't do feel very thing. pleasantly about mm -hmm. you know a woman having two husbands. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's no. a problem. It's a problem. Exactly. Then it's a train yeah. or it's nasty. Right. <laughs> and then you ran through. Yeah, right? you ran through, or you're a hoe because you want two men. You're a hoe. Right. Exactly. You're so, for the street. Exactly. <laughs> and they the ones for the street. Child. <laughs> <laughs> but in other countries. That's the norm. Having multiple wives. Because, but who they runs have those the money countries? for that. No. Yeah. But my thing, who runs those countries? The men. Yeah. So that's why it's a norm. I mean the men run our country. In they Korea, just know they can't do it. In Korea, they don't women have money. can't even cut their hair like they want to. They like they run everything. In other countries, women can't even they have to be fully clothed, they can't mm -hmm. even show their face because the men are controlling that yep. narrative. Yeah, that's that's, That's why it's, it's like that in other countries. That's the one. But I think it too. It goes back to some of those religions. I don't think it's the men. It's some of those are religious based. That's why they have multiple wives. Also, especially true. like Mormons. That's that's religion based where they mm -hmm. have multiple wives. Um, African cultures. That's why they have multiple wives. Mm -hmm. But now, but they're not in that though. Don't agree with in it, Africa. But then that that's they go with it just because of that because it's a religious belief. Mm -hmm. Now over here, yeah, we're free. So you're free to do that. Do you don't necessarily you have to. So, but I think people are going back to that. 
don't know why. But because, it's, like I said, it's people, they're looking at it as it's the funny. sex aspect. They're not looking at what all it comes with. Like, um, Kevin Hart did an interview, and he talked about how his friend didn't realize what was going to come with the swinging. Because he convinced his girlfriend to do it because he wanted to sleep with um, another guy's wife. Yeah. But he didn't realize that his wife was going to be sleeping with that the husband. Yeah. And when he seen it, it traumatized him. So, um, <laughs> look, see, y'all need to, before y'all be trying to convince y'all girlfriends to do stuff, realize that, um, there's more to come with it. Yeah. <laughs> like, come on now. Like, I feel like the girl needs to be equally as comfortable with it. Like, yeah. if, you, if you're if you trying to, like, force your, your woman to, you know, be in a, po a polygamy relationship, it's it's gonna cause a lot a lot of drama between both yeah both girls mm -hmm. you and her like it's just because it's gonna be a toxic I feel like at that point that's where as a woman you have to realize that somebody's trying to force you yeah. to do something exactly. and you need to Leave. exit yeah yeah, yeah absolutely because yeah. Then, that's something about living do y'all sleep in the same bed. Just is he like, only gonna have sex with one tonight? He don't want you tonight. Mm -hmm. Like I got a problem with that. What if he See. you know say I don't want like. You, she's sleeping with me tonight. You're sleeping with me tomorrow. Like we're not doing that. Like we're not doing that. We're not doing that. It's gonna be what one you mean? Submissive woman that's gonna be into that because she gonna have to be the one and be like, well, he's with her tonight, so I'm okay to. I can't know. I can't know. Submissive woman don't want to be in that kind of relationship. I don't even know if that has anything to do with being submissive. I just feel like you have to be a woman that is 100% confident and sure of yourself. That's what I read. I'm not that confident. I'm not that confident. Yeah. 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 You can call me insecure. I don't care what it is. I guess I'm not that confident. Yeah, I'm not. You can't tell me nothing. I wish you would tell me you got to sleep in the other one tonight. I wish I would. That's where I draw a line. That's what I'm saying. That ain't going to work for that type of woman. It's going to have to be a more submissive woman. You're going to have to. That's where I'm like, where is the income at? Because if we're all splitting things, that means I went third on this bed and you can't tell me where I came from. Like, what if you hear them? See, like because y'all not eat. like y'all want to talk about it. We are gonna talk about it. Like, what if you just hear them having sex? I'm like, just getting mad thinking about it. You know, <laughs> it's, 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 I got you in a relationship. They don't want you to join. Like, well, what if they all in a relationship? What you think going on? You go hurt. You go. And because it ain't like you can get up and leave and go get something to your own. It's like y'all in a relationship. What you think going on? But people don't think about that stuff. Like, how would you really feel if it wasn't your turn tonight and you had to sit and listen to that? Because it's, it's, no. really, it's not like you can just get up and go find a man on your own. Or it's, like, or like he starts showing more attention to the other to one, one and not the other. And it's it's a because like I said, it's not like you can say fuck this. I'm gonna go find another man for yeah. right now. You no, can't do that. No, I don't care. That whole part would be talking. Or can like, you? Me. See, that's what I don't get. Can like, you just be like, if, well, if they're doing their own little thing, can I go out and do my own little thing? So I, and that becomes an open relationship. See, what's the difference? It's the same thing. thing. No, nah, polygamy is actually committed relationship. And this, for one, I want to disclaim that it is illegal in all 50 states. It is? Polygamy is illegal. Oh, so why y'all keep trying to cheers to it? Yeah, people do it. But it is illegal to be married to multiple wives. Oh, that's why they just date work. multiple people and but consider they, that they, polygamous. They even right. say, they even say, like common law is the same thing. So if you're in a relationship in, for more than six months in certain states, it's illegal. But y'all have to be living together. You have to be living together. Don't just go out so and get three people, girlfriends course, and say, I'm doing it. They don't do that. That's it's what they illegal. do it. It's illegal. You're <laughs> going to jail. So people do <laughs> it, but well, they, they ain't doing it because you can be in jail. So I'm just they need to be in jail because that's ridiculous. I'm not going to say they need to be in jail, but yeah. I'm just saying you're going they to jail. They need to get their life together, but no, this is a whole other. <laughs> I can't judge, but let me not say yeah. it. <laughs> I just don't get it. And then also with the whole threesome thing, I feel like if you, if your woman likes women as well, I can I can see y'all. I can mm -hmm. see that. But if she don't like women and so That don't mean I want to share. Just because I like women does not mean I want to share my man. True. I, I don't even want to share my woman. Yeah. True, but I mean, I could see why they would if they both like, you know, if she likes women too or whatever. But I no, just don't now I want to bring a man in. Now that's gay. Mm -hmm. That's just that gay shit. <laughs> hey, why? Why? <laughs> That's my thing. It gotta go both ways. If you want to have fun, you gotta let your woman have fun too. Because it's always the men that's like, let's do this, Ugh. let's do this. You wanna have a threesome? Sure, which one of your homeboys? Mm -hmm. I bet you wanna ask me again. Like, <laughs> yeah. And then I was reading, it was like, um, I was on Google last night looking at all this stuff. <laughs> 
And it was basically like, I feel like a lot, not all women, but a lot of women, they they jump into polygamy relationships to fix their relationships, to make the mm-hmm. man happy. Just leave, And that's where babe. it fails. That's, that's what I'm saying. Just leave, you know, but. That's not fixing nothing, but helping him yeah. cheat in, in your face. In your he's face. He's happy, but you're not happy. You're miserable. Like, you're, he's cheating in your face. Yeah. Like, that's just what But it on is. the flip side, I've been seeing more women with multiple men. Like I just, See, I was just going to say that. Just she wants to try to be so like, Mr. Fix her relationship. Me. Why would she just go get Now, of course, the men, <laughs> some of them, the men aren't in a relationship, but I've seen one where the men are together, too. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, oh. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. Pause. <laughs> when you say the men are together, like sexually. Oh, so like you go get a bisexual man. So basically, what you're saying is only a bisexual man will be okay with being in a polygamous relationship. I ain't saying that because I, I mean, did see a couple and they, they, they didn't make it seem like that the men were together, but she was like, this woman has two husbands. Mm-hmm. Which I'm like, so I'm, I'm either going to have mean, both of them tonight or Chad that, that tonight. That they're sleeping together. Tomorrow. That's what I'm saying. But how would that work if they not? Because men are more territorial than women. So how could you be with a woman, two men be with one woman? And just like they there's a lot of ways to not be in the issue. I'm, like they run tra- train. No, no, nah, nah, I'm talking in a relationship, not just sexually. I mean, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I ain't <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So it gets deeper because you got to be pretty mature to handle that to me. I feel like the guys would put themselves in a bromance relationship. Okay. Okay. Uh, um. <laughs> I'm trying to. I wish I could find this. Like, if you like, put yourself like, in a relationship with two men, I feel like the two men would just form a bromance relationship and mm-hmm. you would go about life as, as, you know, these two are more so really, really close friends. So they talk about, you know, income together. They oh, talk about bills okay. together. They okay. go hang out together. But it's no weird. It's no what oh, okay. they would consider weird shit. I honestly, so, I honestly could see men doing it better than women because women are very catty and catty like i said so that's I how that girl see, in, 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 you know in, it happening in the better like, yeah. if it's two men you know what i mean because like women are more emotional and you know and i feel like when it came down to the kids they would be mm-hmm. easier to co-parent with together than it be a two bunch women. of women like she's not gonna tell my daughter people, right? people are jumping you know, on, on this particular post people are like well can you imagine that's that's three incomes and they can all support each other, and I'm that, like, but most of the time the wives don't work. Do they not know that? When when you go to the other countries, the wives are not working; they're yeah, at home. That's true. So yeah. it's not multiple incomes. They always want to. In America, it would be multiple stuff. incomes because we don't have no money. Right. They don't have, have no, no money. choice. They be the main ones wanting stuff and can't cover it and do it. <laughs> so like they always want to say, well, other people are doing it. Well, other people can do it because they can afford it. Afford it. America doesn't have the you money to have fully good relationships. You want to do it because you want to be able to weird. have sex. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, then you need to be able to pay it. Yeah. Exactly. How you want me to put up with somebody else and cover bills? Oh no. no. That's not for Because honestly, really. if you're not financially stable enough to handle no. the polygamous lifestyle is basically just a whole house. It's Charlie's <laughs> Angels, pretty much. No, damn. I like that movie. Don't I love that. that movie too, but basically, I mean, Charlie with a bunch of angels. Don't do that. And everybody works. Everybody goes half on stuff. Everybody has their own source of income. Mm-hmm. It, that's uh, That sounds unsatisfactory to yeah. me. Yeah. <laughs> unsatisfactory. <laughs> So I'm going to read some that she sent me a lot of things, okay. but I'm going to read one of the uh, paragraphs that she sent me. So basically I had asked her, you know, what it does, basically does, do they, do you, I wouldn't tell you. you read a word for word. So basically does the other partner have to improve? So she was like, I'm going to use John Doe, so I don't want to use her name. So she was like. Does the other partner have to approve? John Doe and I are such a tight-knit couple that if the other didn't approve, it wouldn't work out for us. We're trying to grow a family unit that wouldn't work if everyone didn't get along. I believe John Doe and I trust each other's judgment, and if one of us saw something in the additional partner that was an issue, we would address it right away. So what I like about that is they... They agree. They have to agree on who they bring into their relationship. You know, um, 
Because a lot of these men, like the women, the, the, some of the women just don't have a say. So like, so a mm-hmm. lot of these men, they're just like, you know, they don't, they don't give mm-hmm. the woman the option. Mm-hmm. But I, what I like with them is that they basically come to a, like, I guess a middle ground, common, common ground. So, to so then my the question would be, what are they looking for? So, so I had, I tried, somebody tried to recoup me and I just, I ran, but mm-hmm. um, he said that he was looking for his second wife because he already had a first one. I said, what are you talking about? <laughs> um, but neither here nor there. And I was like, so what would the second wife do? Or is she still below the first wife? Like, I would consider myself is, below the first lo- first wife you know if I mean? them two have to decide to pick me So together. then, like, what would your I would feel be? like I'm Would you just lower. be the sex doll? See, I could, I wouldn't be a, I wouldn't be comfortable with like, not you know, nobody's this yeah. team. You know, because then what would your role be if she, if they're already a unit? Because they they was together before you came, and they're choosing you. So then, are you coming? Like, what would you be doing? Mm-hmm. What was your role? You would still be. Would you be a maid? Wife, but... Would you be a maid? No, I feel like you would just take turns. Like, say, um. I, it's just me and him at first, so of course I'm cleaning the house. Mm-hmm. But now that you're here, now that we can split that down the middle, it makes it easier on me. But mm-hmm. now we just split all of the chores down the middle. If we split the bills, now that's just another person to work and bring in. Now instead of paying half the rent, I'm paying. Mm-hmm. A third. So then, yeah. so then, how would the discussions go? Because if y'all already been together and y'all have an actual, you bring her in, do y'all discuss everything with her, or do no, y'all no, just say? You have to, especially if you're if, if she's a wife. Like say now you have to discuss now, everything together. Now say, she's just say a girlfriend. y'all built I mean, up a business together. Y'all bought this house together. Y'all bring her in. Are you going to be discussing every, like the business, everything with her, the house? To. I don't have to do nothing. If they're married, if like, they're married, you, you would have in to. If you're in as a wife, or otherwise, then y'all would just you'll have a like say she y'all want to sell the house and she say no, then what? Mm. Y'all gotta agree. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Y'all don't got a choice. You don't got a choice. <laughs> you don't got a choice. I'm the first wife. Right. So that's, 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 the my that's what problem right there. <laughs> Argument. That's bad. Yeah. See, like, or, that's why I feel like it would be easier with men. Yeah. Exactly. Two men, it would be a lot easier. Because, because I don't want to do that. Because y'all are. Because, you know what? <laughs> we all say that. <laughs> Because like that's our that's conversations that will need to be had. Mm-hmm. Or say y'all get to a point in the business where y'all want to sell it and just travel or something. And she be like, no, mm-hmm. I don't. Even think- if there's not a business, like, what, if there's what if there's something more common? What if there's no, 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 Abby, now look at her. <laughs> no, because you said she's a wife now, so you gotta. <laughs> and if you have kids, what? How would you do that as a mother? Like mm-hmm. she came out of my pum pum, so yeah. Now she said, I don't think I don't like how she's treating. Right, like, or then how you talk about or let, you we can use the orange <laughs> and the black scenario. That girl, she was considered first wife. They brought another wife in. Mm-hmm. She already had a child, a daughter, with her husband. She's mm-hmm. first wife. This mother, I believe, she already had kids of her own. I believe, but anyway, the first wife, she was like, I don't want her ears to be pierced. The little girl wanted her ears pierced, but. First wife was like, I don't want my daughter, because it was her daughter. I don't want her ears pierced. Too so the second wife went out one day while first wife was out or whatever she was doing, and she went and got that little girl's ears we pierced. We were fighting. So how would you feel home. as that girl's <laughs> biological mother, and you went behind my see, back and went see, and got my daughter's ears pierced, and I already said no. That's the same as if it was you, you, you and your husband. If I don't want my daughter's ears pierced, no, because no husband time would be like, yeah. we're no. parenting. Mm-hmm. But no, yeah. nine times that's it's different. Nine times out of ten, the husband ain't gonna do it. If you, if I say you, she you know ain't I don't her, say that. Don't do that. She not. It's no. It's different if a technically a stranger is brought in and now she got to say so. We don't share head. nothing. My child shares no blood with you. No. We, then my child has a bond with you as the second wife and as her second mother. But I already said before you got here. Yeah. That I didn't want her ears pierced. I'm the one who gave birth to her, raised her, you know. And you thought so, just because so you're second wife and second mom, you could go. The moral of the that. story is, you y'all need to start thinking about what's gonna come after, and stop thinking about the fun, speaking to America. The, fun, the fun part of it, the fun part. Y'all need to think about what's all going to come, like. It's illegal here, so Come on, you don't have to think about it. Yeah, the whole point of being in open relationship, so you don't have to have Or just be single. Dream. Why do y'all get in committed <laughs> relationships just to do this? Whenever yeah. you could just be single and not have to deal with no extra headaches. I don't 
don't get yep. the logic behind this. Like, this is stupid. Like, why not just date and go on about your life? But see, that's what they're doing. They're not in polygamous relationships. They're just dating. They have one girlfriend, and then him and that one girlfriend go pick up another girlfriend. That's not a polygamous, that's not a polygamous relationship. But they, yeah. they're committed that's just, still, though. If I'm dating... And but they're not talking about they're not all living together, especially if it's more than three of them. Like, you know, I'm not that's too much. I don't want no extraness. We ain't gotta we ain't gotta have conversations. Mm -hmm. Do what you do, do what I do, stay clean, because I don't play that. Stay like clean. I like why even get into why people get married and say, Oh, See, that's it's another thing, marriage. cleanliness. Mm -hmm. What is an open mm -hmm. marriage whenever you could have just been single? Mm -hmm. To me it's it's like your cake and eating it too. Because you wanna be married to this person. Is that but how you the know. saying goes? You want your cake and eat it too. Because yeah. you want the cake. But you, but you, you can still eat it though. You, you can still have. <laughs> but my thing is you can still have the cake. If y'all are sleeping together every now and then, that's still having it and still doing your thing while he's doing his thing. Why mm -hmm. get married to somebody and combine all The marriage all stuff? part is because he, they basically don't want you to be with anybody else. But they're still being with other people. Yeah, your relationship but you is still know open. That. Your marriage is still so open. So it's like the, but they're still the open part. The it's still open controlling part to me. Both, you both agree that's the whole, the open part. But see, that's the thing, so, though. Is if control. I want to go out and dip my honey in another person's pot, or whatever, dip mm -hmm. my stick in another person's pot, <laughs> but you say, no, I don't approve of Jim Bean. Mm -hmm. That's controlling to me, because yeah. why not? My, me and my queen cat do. We yeah. approve. Yeah. Stamping that's all. Approve. Just, just to cut out all the extraness, just be single. I don't get, I don't, under, I will never if understand. If some people don't do it right off, like, I know, I can't say that. But it's some say. people, it's some people that don't do that until they in a marriage for some time. Like you don't go into your marriage already knowing. Then hey, separate. I'm gonna get a divorce. But like it's some people, they've been spicy. together for some years and then they're like, I, I know I'm gonna cheat. In the world. Right. Instead of knowing, instead of running behind my wife back, I'm mm -hmm. gonna tell her, hey. Let's spice I it up like a bit. How do you person. feel about this? Oh, okay. Okay. The divorce papers will be on the counter <laughs> in the morning. You can like whoever you want, but I'm not going to be here. Where I think the. But when uh, you've been married for that long, yeah, a that lot easy. more than just the paper sign. Yeah. yeah. It ain't that easy to just say, oh, I'm It's not. Because then you got. It's as easy long as for I can have like somebody easy. else. But trust mm -hmm. me, divorce is not easy. It's not. It's a lot of long you've been married. Okay, you can separate until the divorce is final. Like, come on now. I'm not going to stay. Anyway, I'm not. You, why? And there's been people that have done that and then recovered and then have a good marriage. So yeah. you gotta be with. It's it's all on what. You it's all about communication with your partner. If, if you know you can't and, handle that, then fine. Oh okay. yeah. But if well, I'm, you think you I'm can, the first to say, don't come it to me with nothing. Then you would be the one that when your husband came in, <laughs> right. like, you know what? Let's spice it up. Let's you don't know, try to open it up a bit. No, no, thank you. Divorce papers. He's like, you yeah. know what? I expected that. That's mm -hmm. cool. <laughs> yeah. Bye. It's fine. And yeah. that's just that. Because just like you like somebody else, I can go out here and find somebody else to like too. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's a billion people out here. But see, my only issue with that is it's still controlling because you're still telling your partner, I don't like this person, so you can't go sleep with them. Mm -hmm. And it's like, but. We didn't ask you. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't ask you. No, it's just too much for me. It's too much. I got my own issues. I got mm -hmm. time to be trying to have somebody else here with their issues. I don't have time to be clocking somebody else's work. Like, I don't mm -hmm. have time for that. I have yeah. my own stuff, like you said, going on. Mm -hmm. So I don't have time to. What if you and like your it. husband okay, argue? Like what if him and her first like argue that she trying to come in and back him up? Like, <laughs> I wish you like said that. <laughs> John Doe. Mm -hmm. If me and John Doe are, argue, are arguing and we're in a mm -hmm. heated mm -hmm. argument, it's she heated. <laughs> and she comes in and tries to back door and say, well, you know, he did. Hold on, wait a minute, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> what's up to you? I'm like, we can have the polygamy later. This is the two-part argument right now. I'm like, you go to your room. Go to your room. Go to your room. like my mom. If y'all are, if one person sits me down and is like, hey, you know, you've been kind of off mm -hmm. a little bit lately, I would be like, you know what, we can talk <laughs> about it. But it's two of y'all and y'all are both coming at me for the same thing. So y'all can talk about, my, talk about me behind my back? 
Okay. That's what I'm. That's what I'm thinking. Y'all, y'all with, y'all my husband, me. with my husband. With my husband. Because if oh, you want to get to it, I'm y'all's first. Y'all's Ain't no y'all. She's she number two. And she's number two. She, I was here before she was. But now I feel like I'm being talked about behind my back. And even if she was number one and I was number two, it's still a problem. Because why are you talking about me behind my back? See, that's yeah. too much. See, you see what I mean? Y'all ain't thinking about these that's issues, too much. these questions. Mm-hmm. And that's why I say it would be easier with two men because we're a bunch of women feeling the same way about the same situation. Oh, yeah. Emotions on two. Any relationship is going to be problems. And you add more on top trying to balance a whole I other person in there because I, I feel like two men could sit a woman down and be like hey you know what you've been acting kind of mm. I feel like they could get that mm-hmm. and handle that situation a lot better than don't a man let, and a woman with let, one woman because you're not going to try to check me in my house that's mm-hmm. all I'm going to say and I'm like that's a strong woman to deal with two different because I one is enough for me headaches so you can deal with two. That's why you. That's why the women would have to stay at home and the men would have to go to work because with the women also going to work and everybody going half on bills, it's you have a much. lot of women trying too to balance pain. their masculinity and their too femininity. Many, yeah, and that's not too work. much, too much, too much going on. Because now I'm coming at a woman and we're trying to have a decent conversation, but I'm coming at her and my masculine energy because I mean I'm going mm-hmm. half on bills, I'm going to work, mm-hmm. I'm having to deal with this man, and I'm also having to deal with these other and women. Let's just say the man, the husband ain't perfect, so I'm sure he still be doing stupid stuff and getting on their nerves. But you know they just gotta times two. I can do. No, ma'am. No. But I feel like as a woman trying to date two men, you would definitely pick people that you know you could live with. Like I know I would pick the See, cleanest men. Yeah. I know I would. But you still want to be a, a draw. No, no, but in that, that, that look now, I'm not going to use me for example. Because I judge. I judge. Because I'm looking <laughs> at myself. You're use me for example. Because I'm, I'm looking at myself. I, I thought I picked somebody I could live we with. We all thought. Well, he clean. I I he, he don't. But the, up here. <laughs> Oh, see, I'm looking at everything because I'm also looking at myself. I'm a very clean person until it comes to clothes. Yeah. Clothes is, I have what, too much stuff, not enough space. Yeah, that's my issue. Yeah. So with the clothes, that's where I'm, I have clothes in my car. I have clothes in my apartment. I have clothes in my closet. I have extra clothes everywhere just in case you never know when you're going to need an extra this. pair or an outfit change. You never know. petty you are, how much common sense you got. <laughs> Oh, that's looking at all um, of that too. But if I have to live with you, or men are you know already boundaries. a little. Yeah. If you know boundaries. What if, she, what if you come in and she got on your clothes? <laughs> oh. See, I'm talking about me living <laughs> with two men. Like, uh, we're like. I'm talking about like, me living with two men. Too. I know men, I could be. I bet not see no nigga in my clothes. <laughs> no, I'm talking about me. I don't even like, use that word on here, but yeah. goddamn, I bet not see no man in my clothes. <laughs> Like, like, what, I, don't I don't know men don't do it. I know some men that do it. I wish I would come home and see my husband in my in, in my mirror. You like that? Sexy? Sexy? No. There will be none of that. Come on now. No. I know for a fact I would never pick no man that does that. Yeah. No. I'm just saying, God, we're they not just playing about all this. Like, y'all want two wives, y'all can be fight y'all can be breaking up fights every day. That like she come in there, she got on the You finna be a bad girl's club she producer. Got, what she even got to Security. Purse? Like, oh, I, I didn't think he was, you wasn't, you hadn't, you know, carried it in a while, so I thought. But see, that's why I say I like that they you discuss, because, because now I know we're not going to pick a woman that's going to feel free to go in my closet. It's yes. your boundaries. And what I like about <laughs> the she most, still do it. Yes, and what I like about the most is that she is the one that I guess, like, interviews. Oh, okay. okay. So she picks them out, and if it's going good for, like, the first few days, she, she meets with them in person. Oh, so you've been oh, having to okay. break up with people? Huh? If it don't work out, you have to break up with them after the first few days. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> like, like, so they text. So they text. Like, um, they text for a few days, and then they FaceTime. That's too much part. They should period. Yeah, like a probationary she, period. She giving the interviews? Like, yes, that like, that's too much. Well, how else would you expect but that I, to go? I would rather have it that way. So, because I would, I would oh, want it. If, if, if I'm not comfortable true. with the, the third woman coming in, it's, it's, it's not going to work. You know, basically. So I know I wouldn't pick a, a, a woman that was going to wear my stuff. Yeah. But my thing is, that's where you find it. That's where you find it. Like, oh, I mean, I've had, I've had, had, like, uh, I had women funny. come to me. No, mm-hmm. I've had women come to me I, on my, in my, my DMs. Out. They were trying to recruit me. Talking about they're looking for a number two. What does that mean? Like, a second wife? What do you mean? What does that mean? I'd be interested. Literally, a number two. I would be like, I'm not interested, but I'm interested. Yeah, I just want to know how it works. I, 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 I
I've had them come to me via DMs on mm-hmm. all social platforms, mm-hmm. reaching out to get a number two or even just hey, a little night. My man like, was scanning and oh, he I'm said flattered. he liked your page. Mm-hmm. You would you like for us to come have drinks with us? No, nope, I know what y'all doing. See when you <laughs> look at me like that, <laughs> when you word it like that, I know you're only doing this for your man. Hey, my man likes your page. Yep. That's where you turn me off. Nope, I'm not interested doing. if your man we was were in New Orleans and we saw a swingers convention. And like we didn't oh, know what it was at first. We just saw a bunch of people, but it was a man, a man and a woman. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> and that's what I'm just saying. I just wanted to see walking in the thong, like with a clear. Just the, all that. Like okay. you said, her husband got a thong on too. Hey, and I, went, I bet they was matching. They had on all white. My man better not be walking with so no. So all see, white. Like, all white. Like, <laughs> people going into this hotel. I was like, it's a swingers convention. I'm like, they I just want right. to see what it's like. Yeah. I'm like, you know what it's yeah. like. No, no, I don't. I don't. Go in there. Go in there. You don't think they're really dress up like that. I bet there's like a yeah. a word that you use. You know what I mean? There's, yeah. right. there's having sex in there. Like a secret code. Like I remember an episode of Law and Order where they were trying to get into a club like that and there's a secret code or a secret word. They, they have the hotel. There. I bet they do. Nice go in there if you want to. I probably ain't going to come out that same. Just to figure out. Because you don't have to be... A couple to be in a sing- yeah. swingers club. I'm not going in there. And stuff You're like not, that. They won't. You right. can go as a recruit. Like, hey, mm-hmm. like, what do you wear? Like, yellow or orange? Or yeah, how do you, 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 white you get a certain like, type of drink to let them know that you're a recruit and that you're single? <laughs> okay. okay. Or something okay. like that. That's actually. Yeah, no, I'm a dark. I'm, I'm, go, I'm gonna, gonna, gonna be talking to nobody. <laughs> 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 Standing in the corner. You're like, man, we gotta get out of here. You just know you don't belong here. You gotta participate now. They gonna tell you that participate. I'm not ready yet. I just let me eat. I just had to dip my toe in. <laughs> no, never mind. I was gonna say something on camera. My dad watched it. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna do it one day. I was gonna say. I was gonna say that we should all go together. Go up one day. Just so they can't get us. They can't get us there. Like this is a project. This is an assignment for our show. <laughs> we should go. So when they say we're, we're committed. Just go to the bathroom. Next week. <laughs> Baby, I'm going out the bathroom. <laughs> We got a cold red, they trying to take me. We got to come up with a word, a cold word when it's time to go. I'm like, oh, old so white man. Scotch. What, what is, why should be the old white man trying to approach us? Mm-hmm. They be the ones with the money. I might entertain mm-hmm. you from getting a little leg rub. Yeah. Get a little leg rub for that card. But it be the they don't people do that you would least expect. I was telling them. They can rub elbows. I met a woman that was into the BDSM. <laughs> I never knew nothing about it until I met this guy that was editing my book. He's a teacher. He got a whole it, separate it, it be page. Those. He got a whole separate page. <laughs> and he married and all that. And he older. Late 40s, maybe early 50s. They, they and they do the BDS. <laughs> y'all, y'all making me drink. I'm like, yeah. It's like a double no, life. It's y'all that's making me drink like this. <laughs> Gave me this little squalor. Shut <laughs> <laughs> me down this. It's, it's a double life out here, that trick. Yeah, I love being the ones, though. You, trick you trick never me. expect those type of people, but you also expect those type of people. It is always the ones you always mm-hmm. expect. It, it's the teachers and the choir instructors mm-hmm. and the band directors. <laughs> you know who I, and the, I was going to say her name, but she, yeah, y'all know the, the dance teacher. Y'all know who I'm talking about. <gasps> uh, I feel like she, uh, she be the dance teacher. Oh, yeah. Because oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. <laughs> she act like that weirdness. Yeah. Y'all know exactly who I'm talking about. She and how she be walking? Yeah, and then she had something going on. Mm-hmm. That yeah. other, that other man. Uh, it's always no. Deja, no. Deja, no. That should be walking got to do with her. That should be walking got to do with her. No, let me do it. Let me do it. Do it. Do it. What kind of walk? I need to know what kind of walk this is. Let me change up my walk. I'm gonna give it somewhere else. Let me do it. No, yeah. there's somebody in there with us. She be acting funny. And I know you. Let me see. Look, and action. Oh, 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 but oh, those are always the ones. It's your teachers yes, and yes, your right. pastors the people and people next door. It's, it's always the people next saying. door. Look, don't be in my door doing nothing. Please, if I'm moving too. Please, God, don't do that to me. It's the manager that always seems uptight. They gotta let you know. They gotta leave me alone. Mm-hmm. They gotta express themselves some kind of way. Yep. 
But no, I, we, we should do that though. I'm interested I'm, I'm in the down. lifestyle. But we look, I'll be coming up with a code word. Cause look, I'm gonna say it one time and I'm leaving. But if Donald, Donald, Donald get on board, then y'all just gonna be stuck. Cause I'm not. Y'all just see me running. Anytime you make, you can put butterscotch into anything. What's your favorite food, butterscotch? Right? I'm saying butterscotch. What's your favorite color, butterscotch? Y'all don't run with me? That's on y'all. I'm gonna get some butterscotch. Yeah, she ain't gonna finish it. I'm gonna be already coming. It's like your butter. You gonna be looking for me? I'm already gone. Okay, what is that? As soon as I see anything, because let's be real, not everybody to do this is in shape and looking right. I see anything. See, I don't give a fuck about that. I'm nosy. I'm not seeing that. I'm nosy. I'm not gonna get scarred. You're not, I'm, no, as soon as I see yeah. anything sagging. Sorry, be out here. I'm in there. I don't yeah. want to know sagging, no nothing. If I see, I'm, <laughs> Most of the time, it be. I want, because I want to come back with all the details. I saw old ass man off of there. Like, yeah, <laughs> yes. Give it to me all. Like, the judge, the judge, I seen the judge. The judge. Yeah, you don't see him. The Pastor judge. Ricky, you know him? <laughs> see him. See him. I don't know. Like, but, I, you didn't see me. But I'm <laughs> What if we end up seeing somebody we know? I'm, I'm coming like, back with a team. <gasps> do we approach him? I'm like, my cousin see. Anthony. Sing to him. Sing to him. I might do this. Sing to all of them. Let him know. I see you. <laughs> and I ain't gonna say nothing. Look, give you one of these from afar. Yeah. I ain't gonna say nothing, though. <laughs> I'm not. Just, like, just so you know. I see you. I'm not doing it. Yeah, hey, I mean, all of those y'all watching this don't come at me for real. Because I'm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. Doing but don't come it. at like, me. Yeah, you don't judge us. Hey, I'm judging. We like to go to the convention. Okay, that's fine. I don't but don't I'm judging. Nobody do what judge. you do as yes. long as you're not doing it for free. Yes. Oh. Get paid. Get your money. Okay. Do your thing. If okay. you're going to be in a political okay. relationship, you better not be going half on everything. Right. Damn. That too. Like, you better be at home. If you want me to put up with another, you sleep with other females and stuff in the house, you going to cover everything. I'm not going to be working and come home dealing with stuff. Especially if I'm the second and I got to hear number from number one getting her back broken in the night. Okay. I'm not going to work right. tomorrow. All right. That's it. You're I'm not, not going to work not. tomorrow. We're not. I we're just right. want you to know that right now. We're, no, we're I'm not. not. I'm not clocking in. Why, mm -hmm. why are you not going to work today? <laughs> I was off last night. <laughs> Well, I was off last night, so I'm off today. <laughs> it's a floating holiday, and I'm using it. <laughs> so, oh, that too. Do you meet the parents with them? Like, what if they say they... I mean, you would have to in a new one. No, I don't want to be family. No, because what if your, parent, your people don't know, and you're like, you got to stay home. We're going out to eat with my mom. No. Then, then you don't need to be in the fight style. Yeah, then you're cut. It's not for me. You're cut. Like what? Cut if, like money. or it's like money. say because you know they would have already an established relationship with the parents. Like what if they say, oh, it's just us tonight? No. <laughs> then you don't need to be a part of this lifestyle. You need and to then, go home. And then what if the parents like what about pick on you the whole night? And then the parent, but the parents don't approve. So they yeah. just pick it on you the whole yeah, night. Yeah, or like rest. vacations, like vacations. You bet everybody going. Uh uh, if it's a vacation, everybody is going. <laughs> everybody is going. You don't need to do that. Why are you, you don't need to do that. <laughs> No, but how do family vacation? No, let me say, I'm taking her this time. I'm gonna take no, her. No, it's either me and you, or we're not going. No, we're staying at home. If you think I don't know how to go behind somebody's back and cancel some plates, exactly. What if you say he don't got the money for you? Then you don't need to be in this lifestyle. Why you bring me in and you ain't got the money for you? That's because I'm gonna take myself out. Check, please. Well, what if it's just for that one's birthday and she don't want you to come? She wants my long time. That's too damn bad. You shouldn't have. You shouldn't want a long time if you no, agree to look, be in a relationship well, with three maybe people. Maybe she wants to look. Look, these are all. Then the she better go by herself. Yeah. Well, then she better go by herself. Well, she said this is my birthday. Like really you chose the lifestyle, so. but then you don't want. You don't want. You don't I want to have a long time with my husband for a little bit. You like you want some alone time with our. Well, let me let me snap a mustache on and let me get the strap out the closet because I'm your husband too. They all sitting at the table together. I'll be glad when I'm talking. I'm finna eat. <laughs> I'm coming. You can do all the dinners and stuff by yourself, but I'm gonna be in this room. Yeah. I'm gonna be outside yeah. by myself. How about that? Yeah. So you'll be a nanny? No, because we're not bringing no kids. Who brings their kids for their birthday trip anyway? I mean, if you ain't at the home with the kids, the kids gotta come. No, that yeah. means we need to tell the family. <laughs> because we're gonna have the kids, the family, and we're going on that trip. Y'all mm -hmm. going out? No, I want her. She want a long time. She don't want you there. She's tired of you. That's cool. No While they that. do their alone time, See? I'm gonna be outside. I'm gonna be outside. It was your birthday. It was your birthday. 
birthday. You don't want some alone. That's time. what it is. Ignorant. That's what I am. That's ignorant. They say you my mom. No. They say no. But if I was to put myself in a polygamous relationship, that means I 100% understand that this girl is going to have to come no. alone. You so to if she comes that. alone, Everybody you can be outside. Space. You can go to the club Everybody by yourself. Everybody needs space. Then she should have took that whole trip by her own self. Y'all are ignorant. Now, no, if your birthday come around and she all up in y'all faces whenever you want You can you come on the trip, girl. <laughs> come on the trip, girl. But no. you are going to be outside oh, by yourself. salty the whole time? That's cool. And that's your energy, trip. not mine. Yeah. 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 That's your energy, she not mine. And then that's no, why no, my no, husband yeah, is like, yeah, she 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 I don't like her energy, so she got to go home. No, we got at dinner, she just sit like this the whole time. I'm going to my food. Baby, do you want to be here? No, you don't want to be here tonight? Well, then no. you are more than welcome to excuse yourself and go well, back to the room, my love, right. and I will see you later. Exactly. No. What's she saying? No, I'm sitting right here. Well, then, well, like, then we're going to go fix your face. What's the point of me? You just don't get in your life. 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 Now, fix your face. Y'all don't be in the Let somebody tell me to fix my face. <laughs> I'm pretty sure your your life is hell with the two women. I, I, I would like to see a polygamous couple that have been together for years. This That's why I, I, I would have really enjoyed speaking with one. I would, if there is a like polygamous couple out there that you would you like to come on, and yeah. like, I we think can like keep the this as a part first wife and the husband probably switch a minute. I feel like the in the other countries, yes, you would find a lot. Oh yeah, because I mean they are not allowed to work in there, so they they kind of just that's how they brought up. Can I share the pros and cons that my friend shared with me? Sure. Okay, so she was back. So the pros was like, there's more to love. You always have a friend, like the women, I guess. Um, more people to love and parent your kids, which I could see would be beneficial um, if they have good intentions. Exactly. Um, a larger family unit, <laughs> sisterly bond, um, sexual variety. I'm fucking drunk. <laughs> tour and childbearing which we discussed um so the cons were jealousy of course feelings of uncertainty because you honestly never know when you get the jealousy your house yes. competition financially can get costly like i said like we all but said stop public judgment which i could see because yeah. you know yeah. most people because i'm just mm. um i don't okay. care do your thing yeah, yeah. hey hey I mean, just don't ask me no questions because you're really going to be mad at me. Right. I'm going to be asking you. Don't ask me questions if you don't want mine. I'll say that. Right, yeah, exactly. Because I'm like, look, so whenever he tell you that he don't want you tonight and he won't hurt Or does he tell you that he doesn't want like, you tonight? You know, or is he fruitful and he just gives himself to everybody mm -hmm. at the same time? I need a man like that. He ain't got no energy. No, then you need to get that stamina up. What, you better get you a body. Like you that? better do something, a honey packet, something. Right. Because even if we're all getting love tonight. Sometimes I ain't in the mood. So yeah, go on over there and hug. And I could like, see that. Yeah, I could up. see that if there's, a, if, if there's a time where I am on the bench, whether it be because, you know, Mother Flo is in town yeah. or because like, I'm genuinely be in just not feeling it. Y'all would be in sync, You though. would be in sync, but it wouldn't be that close, though. Yeah. But You wouldn't be like, we're going on at the same day. It's never like that. Like a couple days, right? Yeah, a couple days. So, yeah, somebody could be giving up that house attitude. regardless. So, it seems that like. is a lot of attitude, attitude. in one household. Oh, no, mm -mm. not y'all get irritable just because. Mm -mm. And, you, you look at and if, if <laughs> you can be a clean woman, you can be a woman who does you know keep the house clean, you keep yourself up. But not every woman is clean mm -hmm. when that cycle comes. Yeah. And if we're synced up, mm -hmm. ma'am, 
Yeah. I'm gonna need that trash can empty. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need, I'm, I'm need, I don't wanna know. Mm -hmm. I don't wanna know. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh. Y'all, what the hell you put in that drink? Um, Just blood. Like that's that margarita. <laughs> oh, yeah, we, we, uh, margarita. We didn't even tell them what we was drinking, y'all. Uh, we just started drinking. Gloria Margarita Red. Y'all know what this is. It's gone now. It's All gone. <laughs> They know what that is. Yeah, <laughs> we margarita up instead of wound down. I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell my dad wound to down. sit this episode out. Wound down. <laughs> you know, wound okay. down. Wind, wind it down. Wound down. We wound down. Wound down. We wound down. <laughs> <laughs> we wound down. <laughs> Girl, bye. I'm we bye. We're done. We like, wound down. as you can see, that, that, um, she don't even know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, we, um, we're we want to get somebody who is polygamous on yes. the show. That's not what I was about to but say. But that's oh, what we need to do, though. We're closing out now. And that is our closer. <laughs> <laughs> Are we sure to watch live, too? Yes. yes. Okay. I want to keep. I want. I want to actually like get my questions answered. So mm -hmm. I want somebody. Don't be scared. We're gonna be on Instagram next uh, live. So y'all add us. On, I'll put it down below in the description so y'all send me out Instagram stuff. Um. But yes, that concludes this episode. We a little tipsy, drunk, whatever y'all want to call it. Um, so don't judge us. Even though, <laughs> even though we've been judging everybody this whole time. Uh, um, not me. Do what you do. No. You, you was talking about how they do to wear your clothes. Bye. Because <laughs> who wants somebody? Because if you don't wear my clothes, you'll wear my panties. And that's where I draw the line. Okay, bye. Bye. We're done. See y'all next time.